All right, hey guys, what's going on? This is Chris Rozier, of course, and Mikey All-Star here. Today we have another minifigure showcase. Oh, yeah. All right, so today we have the Joker from the newest collectible minifigure series, the DC collectible minifigures. And I believe this Joker is based off of his appearance in the Dark Knight Returns comic slash animated movie. So here we go. This is uh, probably one of my favorite Joker minifigures. It looks really awesome. I love the hair and just everything about it. So... Without further ado, let's take a look at his pieces first. So, of course, he becomes a face stand, as he is a collectible minifigure, but he also comes with this cotton candy piece, which I thought was pretty awesome. I think it was the first cotton candy piece that I've seen in LEGO. I'm not sure if they ever have made uh, any before, but this is really cool. Of course, it is in a nice shade of white pink, and you also have the white stick right there, so he doesn't get his hands all sticky. And then you also have this Joker card. That's right. Yep, he's looking pretty happy. He even has his own card in the picture, as you can see, which is a Batman card. So that is a pretty awesome detail. Like, look at that printing. That's so cool. Anyways, speaking of cool printing, we've got his legs right here. Starting off his legs, you see here, uh, a lot of his minifigure is white, which looks really nice, really just stands out. So you have the white of his legs as well as the printing of the start of his suit. And there is nothing on the back, of course, since they are wigs. And they don't usually print on the back of wigs. Next up here is the torso. He's got this really nice suit on. It looks really dashing and handsome. You've got the whites, of course, as the base. You also have some white gray detailing for little wrinkles and stuff there. And you also have uh, just a suit in general with black outlines for just all of the details right there. He's got a pink, or uh, I guess purple, sort of lilac dress shirt, and he also has this white tie, which really just fits all nicely and makes him look very jokery. Here's the back. As you see here, you've got some uh, gray detailing right there, you've got some wrinkles, and you've got the creases and stuff right there. Looks awesome. Then his arms, they are white with white hands. They really uh, kind of blend together, but it also works well, of course, since his hands are white. And uh, his suit, of course, is white, too. And then his head, as well, is even white, too. It's a lot of white. You've got his uh, iconic Joker smile right there with the red lips, and you've got the teeth showing right there. You've got just a lot of detail going on here. I love his eyebrows, too. They kind of arc up, and they look like he's kind of like a, like a sinister expression on his face. And then, yeah. And then here's his hair. This is the uh, kind of... I believe it's the same hair. Actually, no, it's not the same hair from uh, Mr. Incredible, but it is close. And it is in a nice shade of green. Very uh, unique piece right there. I think it's like lime green or something like that. It's pretty awesome. I don't think he has a double head. Nope, he doesn't. Okay, so there we go. So that is the Joker, the newest version of the Joker. Very awesome minifigure. Probably one of my favorite Joker minifigures right there. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!